Self here. Three-handed. A call from Barry Herm with the Queen Six. And Pamela Chandel with very little. Oh, this could get something for everyone. Yeah. Parks on the button with the pair and the flush draw. Check. Barry <coughs> Hearn with the top pair. Six. And uh, interestingly Six enough, even though Barry has the best hand pair-wise, I think Chris Parks is the favorite at this stage. Yeah, a lot of cards could hit him. That's the trouble for Barry Hearn. We call nice. him with the Queen Six. Raise. He's hit his top pair and he still doesn't exactly know where he is. So he's put a raise in. Six thousand more. He's certainly going to find out where he sits now. Oh. It is the minimum raise. And uh, if it's informational, Chris Parks might give the answer right here. You could see Chris Parks getting very wild with this hand. I mean, it looks like he's got a cool. whole handful. Ooh. Cool. Hmm. Well, any jack, any eight, any diamond. Barry looking a bit worried there. That hasn't changed things. And now, Hearn, in a much stronger position, Parks is the one drawing. Needs to bet quite big to get him off this flush draw and everything. 10,000. Well, Pass. is he enough? Mm, a scratch of the head. Parks gave that up quite quickly, but with the aggression, Barry Hearn takes the pot, and uh, he's won three hands, a fully 50% of the ones that have been played. Tough call for Chris Parks here. Uh, you either go in strongly, perhaps he could have raised with that draw. It was a very big hand to draw to, really. Second Wait, time we've seen phone Barry phone with the two oh, eights. Well, I was born in uh, Connecticut. But that was for a few hours. Really moved. Oh, well. you striked him. You kept the action, though, didn't you? Didn't you? <laughs> 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 Harris with the pair as well. A couple pocket pairs in here. There's a few good hands out here. Boy, I mean, you talk about playing tight. Tony Mackay not living up to his image. Only a call with the jack-10 on the button, and he does not like it. Well, he may well be right oh. when we see what else oh. is out there. 8,000. Because there's a raise. big hand. 8,000 more. Big 10, enough 10, to 10, raise 10. with. 8 wow. to call. And there's a little bit of value if they all would call, oh. if they all should call. And once Barry Hearn calls, that means yeah. that it's there. a bit more attractive awesome. for others to put money in as well, just in case they do hit. Pass. 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 In some ways, he could have Pass. perhaps put money in there. 8,000, he's already put two in. You could have easily seen uh, Ian Harris, especially with the position he's got. Uh, I mean, Chris Parks, I think he meant to take that pot before the flop with the raise. Now he finds himself out of position uh, in against Barry Hearn, but uh, the cavalry has arrived in the form of the ace on the flop. Perhaps Barry Hearn was hoping a couple more people would be in for the value, but he had to make the first choice, and that's where position is important. He had to make an earlier decision. Pseudo connectors, Barry, huh? Small ones? Yeah. Well, he's more or less picked up on what Barry had. Liam Flood <laughs> saying... Liam like <laughs> <laughs> Flood trying to work out what Barry had. <laughs> Shouted across the table, suited connectors, Barry. <laughs> Nearly got it right. Well done. Nice <laughs> <laughs> Any information you can get for free in this game is considered ammunition for the arsenal. You're not going to get much information from this man. Has <laughs> no. he renamed himself the Rockfish? Is this a new name? I don't know if it's been one that's around for ages. Those sunglasses look very intimidating, but next to Liam Flood, he looks small at the moment, doesn't he? He's got a rise in stature, just a fraction. Pass. Oh, and Ian Harris Rose. now getting busy. To 8, total. Hasn't played Pass. many hands, so it will be respected. Yeah, well said. This is only the second time Ian Harris has raised before the flop, and it's a bit of a down dip, but uh, I would imagine they'll have a hard time Pass. taking them on. Pass. Pass. 6,000 more Pass. to Barry, who quickly Pass. mucks them. Easy, Easy money. And, uh, Ian showing there's a few wrinkles to his game. It's not all A, B, C. He just seemed to think the time was right. Yeah, do you think that is a moody WSOP bracelet? You know, was it with that in mind just to scare off the opposition? Or, <laughs> or did he mug 
a previous winner. Well, do we do we know the real truth there? <laughs> I don't know. I used to I used to live with a gambler named Big John, and he, he would wear his entire bankroll on his person in the form of gold jewelry, and uh, when he was running bad, would all end up in the pawn Raise shop. Eight thousand total. I don't really want to know about your personal <laughs> life, but if you feel the <laughs> if you feel the need to tell me, I can be Dr. Davis. <laughs> We've got a big hand here. Ace Queen from Ian Harris. He's raised it to eight thousand and Liam's picked up a monster. Raise. Raise. Twenty two hundred. It's twenty two total. Go on by that. The re raise is fourteen thousand more. Barry Her mucks to King Queen like it was nothing, and it is. Question Liam. is, oh, hold it. He's he raised. Like that, yeah. all in now. It's all in. It's a re-raise and an all in. Re-raised all in and a call. And it's going to be an interesting mm. flop. Yep. Has Ian Harris acted too hastily? The ace <coughs> on the board. On his first time on television, he's only been playing for one year. He needs one of three cards. Would be his lifesaver, but uh, he's in an all-in situation. Good luck. Hi. 181,000 in there, and uh, I always stand up and I'm all this has uh, this has happened very fast, Steve. And uh, Ian Harris does have three outs, but he's in a dire strait. I was getting suitcase ready to go. Ian Harris is looking at three aces. Liam Flood's still got two kings, although one of them's gone with Barry Hearn throwing away King Queen. That queen on the flop, Harris is still trailing, but now there's a queen in the deck. That would give him the best hand. Any ace, any queen. That's no help. One card to come. And Harris has got his suitcase on. He's out. It's so simple to go out of this game, isn't it? One minute you're in, the next minute you're out. A push over the line. And Ian Harris ran into the Cowboys. Queen on the flop was a ray of sunshine, but the Kings beating the Queens. And quickly, this game goes five-handed. You do have to have enormous patience to play this game, to not lose track of where you are. Sometimes you're, you're just desperate to get cards, and sometimes you don't get the cards, so you try and make something happen. And before long, your stack's being decimated. And the experience that you gain from the game can sometimes give you that patience. Yeah, and I mean, success, it's its great to learn off the back of success. It really... Uh, I'm raising. Once raising. I have to think about it. Okay. <laughs> Raise. Well, Pamela, verbal contracts are binding. She'll be held to that. The so minimum... Yeah. Raised to 14,000. Sorry, Jesse, it's at least eight then, isn't it? Yeah, that would be the minimum raise. Okay. She didn't announce anything, but she has um, just put your, your, uh, said 14, which just is 4 plus 10. That's it so people can see. Thank you. But, uh, Fold. Oh yeah, the, the be kind to strangers rule, not in effect. Oh, no, look at this. Liam oh Flood picked up kings again. <laughs> my goodness. Uh, he has to obviously be careful of, the, of the aces, but he's total. got to find out how strong the hand is from Pamela. He's been raising so many hands. What does Pamela think he has? I would imagine the other two lads will get out of the equation oh. here. Yeah, I mean, as this, is a, as they can. this is a great test of uh, so how much time do I have to think? Pamela's escape uh, tactics. Uh, Pamela. Uh, Pamela's uh, huh? Nine seconds. Nine, nine seconds? seconds? Nine. 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 Oh. It's an acre of time. <laughs> <laughs> Thank you. <laughs> You could finish a small novel in that time. The re raise is, is <laughs> 20. Not the way I write. It's 22,000. <laughs> well, she's raised. She's been re raised. What has Liam no Flood got? And Liam no Flood's giving us some verbal as well. What about this? No shame in passing. How can you do that as a line? It's a, it's a very similar hand to the one Ian Harris went out on. Hold. And uh, yeah, Pamela, there's, the <coughs> there's more experience there than in Harris show. Yeah. Well, this has been fun for Liam Flood. That is 
13 Hansies won. 